all the beautiful summer looks. I'm going to use these beautiful reds. This is a nice orange red, hot color for summer. Then the pinks, the light pink and the mauve pink. And just for a different twist on natural, snazz it up with that brilliant gold. So here we go. The first thing you need to do is put a primer. I'm just gonna apply this Avon Magic all over my face. I use it because it primes and it's reasonable. Quick there. The trick to the natural look is not to be natural. <laughs> the trick to the natural look is to be pale. If you look pale, you're gonna look natural. So normally I use a light foundation and follow it with a darker powder to get my exact color. But for this natural look, which is actually a pale look, I am just going to utilize my powder. So I'm just gonna utilize my lighter foundation. And I'm going to be pulling out my pink and mauve undertones. I am a natural yellow, but if you look at my lips, you can see the mauve undertones in there. I'm gonna put a little bit more of my Posner medium stick. Any makeup that makes you a little lighter, more of your winter color than your summer color will do. And I'm gonna Apply it to the lips. There we go. Instead of using my regular powder, which is darker, I'm going to use this Avon powder that comes with its own brush. It has a lot less color than my normal powder. And I have just lightly powdered my whole face. Now, I'm using a Milani Plum Delish. Again, you would have thought that I would use a brown palette to create the natural look, but the browns actually would look more made up on me. I'm gonna use the dark plum color there to create a redness to my eyes, kind of like I just woke up in the morning. I'm not gonna use a traditional liner. I'm just going to use this plum color to line my eyes. Any color that can give you the effect of just a little bit of red around the eyes. I normally don't use brushes, but for this look to mask the look of a I to mask the look of a little bit of reddening of the eyes I had to add the brushes. Now with this same wonderful palette here I am going to go ahead and use it as a blush. Take the whole thing, mix it up. You're going for a pale look. These colors look pale on me and I wouldn't normally use them as a blush and then I'm going to dust my eyes with the same colors just to give me a hint of pop this is Avon as well I have no idea what color it is I have no idea what the name of the color is but it's a cream and I'm putting it just at the top of the brows there. And you see how natural I look with all that makeup on? <laughs> For the lips, I'm going to take my mauve color here. This is by Avon, and what is the color? Natural. <laughs> That's the color. It's natural. I 
and I need to blot this. So this is my first natural look. Looks like I don't have any makeup on, just a little bit of lipstick. And you see how the pale tones create that natural effect for me. Now, we're going to change just the lips. I took off the other lip color. Same makeup, same eyes. Look how made up I look. But to make it more natural, create the look of a lip stain. So I took off most of that orange color. This is Orange Olay by Fashion Fair. And there it is, a natural look with orange. I'm taking that off. And say you want to do just a little snaps. Got your natural look going there. This is on time fashion fair. There you go. Take that off. Say you're a gloss girl. This no longer has a name on it. It's Milani. It's by Milani. And it is in the mob family. You see I'm sticking with colors that are pale. And you're ready for the beach. This color has some protection on it. Just to let you know, I did add a little mascara after I finished my first look. So I have on mascara with this look. If you're going to the beach, use a waterproof look. And I hope you enjoyed my recommendation for summer looks. A pale makeup with sunscreen. Use colors that bring out the natural undertones, red, pinks, purples on your eyes, no eyeliner, no brow powder, and have fun with the lipsticks.